Imagine getting up every morning and finding out you're waking up just a little bit richer than when you went to sleep last night. This is the reality for a lot of people right now who are into digital marketing and learning how to sell digital products online. And in this video, we're going to be diving into five ways on how to sell digital products and make that dream a reality for you. Now, obviously, before you can sell a digital product, you have to have a digital product to sell. So if you're still stuck on how to create digital products or what types of digital products to create, make sure you check out this video here where I cover all of that. I'll leave the link in the description too as well. Make sure you watch that first so that you have an understanding of the products you can actually sell. I also have a list of 117 digital product ideas that you can literally create within a day that you can download for free. Link is in the description too as well. All right, let's dive right into it. One of the first and best ways that you can sell your digital products is with a personal website or a blog. Now you can use website services like WordPress or Shopify to create your own personal website. And on those websites have a shop or a library where you can host all of the digital products that you wanna promote. This is a great option for multiple reasons, but one of the best reasons is the long-term success that you can have with selling your products on a personal website because a personal website will also allow you to build your personal brand and having a personal brand can open so many doors and opportunities for you that sometimes just isn't there if you're just pushing digital products out there without having a brand associated with it. Now, if you're not ready for a full-blown website, you can start off with what I call mini websites like Stand Store or Linktree, which are services that allow you to create products or host product links within that particular site so that you have a one-stop shop place for people to go to and to drive traffic to so that they can see what products are available to them and make a purchase. The second way of selling digital products online is taking advantage of already existing marketplaces. For example, a popular marketplace for selling digital products is Etsy. Etsy allows you to create your own digital store and then upload products such as planners, calendars, guides, anything that you can think of when it comes to digital products, you can create and upload within Etsy. And Etsy makes it very easy for people to be able to download those products after they purchase and it allows you to handle customer service keep track of your analytics and all those other things that are necessary to be able to grow and scale a digital product business or if you're thinking about going the online course route you could take advantage of marketplaces like udemy where people are constantly searching for different types of courses to take and you can upload your course there and based off of people's interests and what they're searching for can find your course and be able to purchase it from there the third way to sell your digital products is using social media you can take advantage of all the social media platforms out there like Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, or Twitter. I know it's X, but I'm calling it Twitter. <laughs> but you can take advantage of all of these social media platforms to be able to promote your products, as well as some other platforms too as well, like Pinterest, for example, which is a great social media platform that you can utilize for selling digital products that a lot of people don't really take advantage of. And on social media, your main focus is to create engaging content that's going to drive people to your profile. And typically in the bio of your profile, that's where you can host a link either to your stand store or to your personal website where your products are located and people can click that link and then go into your library to be able to choose whatever product they want. The fourth way to sell your digital products online is through email marketing. Now email marketing has been here basically since the birth of the internet but it's still a great way to be able to sell your digital products online. Benefit of email marketing is if you're doing it right which means you're building an email list that's a big mistake make sure you're building an email list to begin with. Email marketing allows you to be able to sell to your customers on that list or to grow and scale your business by offering further discounts, upselling, downselling. There's so many different methods that you can take advantage of with email marketing that you aren't able to really do with any of these other platforms or methods that I've mentioned so far in this video. Services like MailChimp or ConvertKit are just a few examples of email marketing softwares that you can take advantage of to be able to sell your products online. And most of these platforms start off with a free plan and then you can grow from there based off of your needs. Lastly, the fifth way to sell your digital products, which is one of my personal favorites, affiliate marketing. With affiliate marketing, what you can do is you can partner with other businesses, influencers, and entrepreneurs to sell and promote your digital products. Now, when you do that and they make a sale, you're actually paying them a commission for making that sale. But the beauty about this model is you're getting sales that you would have never gotten if you didn't do affiliate marketing in the first place. And you can do this with any type of digital product and it's a great way to scale your business. So to sum this all up, you can really have massive success with with selling digital products online. If you are focused on making sure you're selling the right types and kinds of digital products and then leveraging one of these five methods that I've gone over to actually sell and promote them. And as long as you're mindful and you're using effective marketing techniques and you're talking to your right target audience, the potential for what you can earn is literally uncapped. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button to get more tips and tutorials on how to start and grow your own digital marketing business. And as always, remember, you only live once, so make it count and I'll catch you on the next video.